Hi all, it's Katherine Burgess with Burgess Group Compass. We are talking about local and national headlines and then we'll get into the nitty gritty for Boulder County real estate. So last week we had a normal number of new listings come to market and uh, there's still a huge dearth of inventory. Nationally, the quantity of homes that are for sale is down by about 50% over uh, what we saw pre-pandemic. Last week we had 85 new listings come to market. I'm gonna let the charts speak for the numbers, but as you can see, that is in the realm of normal. However, our overall quantity of inventory is still much lower than normal. So uh, 79 properties went under contract. That's better than what we've been seeing with, uh, you know, it's at the low end of normal. The most important thing to think about right now is the year to date under contract rate. Now, as you may recall, that is a coincident indicator. It's telling us exactly what's happening in the market right now. So it's really important. Um, and we have had 568 contracts under contracts happen in 2022. Um, that is about 200 lower than what we saw in 2018, 2019, 2020, and 2021. So that is a real dip in the amount of activity that's happening in our marketplace. It's a very big difference for us. So sellers remember that. That has to do with the shortage of inventory. There's no lack of buyers if there's a lack of inventory. So from a price band perspective, last week we had the 2.5 million and above kind of quiet, 1 million to 1.5 a little quiet, zero to 500,000 also a little quiet. So there may be a little bit more given those. Right now there's so little inventory, there's not a lot of give anywhere. So moving on to the national stuff, um, two years ago was when the World Health Organization stated that we were in a pandemic on March 11th. So what has happened to our national housing market since then? Essentially, we have had a huge change. Remote work and super low inventory came together and created this massive bubble of buyer demand that impacted our housing shortage. We already had a housing shortage and then we added all these extra buyers to the mix. So right now, homes are 34% more expensive than they were pre-pandemic year, year over year back to 2020. They are at a median sale price of $369,000 uh, nationally. And buyers are grappling with fierce competition. Buyers are twice as likely to pay more than asking price and two thirds of offers have a multiple offer scenario. So it's really challenging. It's a challenging time nationally. It's challenging locally. All that said, um, sellers, this is probably, we have never seen this little inventory nationally or locally. Check out the chart below that shows you exactly how much in demand it, the inventory is. And, uh, know that you know there's not a type of inventory that is not needed by buyers right now. So it's a great time to exit the market and possibly reap rewards that you weren't expecting to get, um, retire early or you know put your kids through college or whatever it is. So uh, then buyers, don't be disheartened. Our Interest rates are going up, but they are still at these incredibly low levels, historically speaking. And like our practice just got five people under contract this week, five buyers. So it can be done. Uh, you need to work with uh, an agent who really knows what they're doing and knows how to use the contract and you need to be coachable. As you saw, we've had 568 under contracts this year so it is happening with the question of am i overpaying right now do keep in mind that core logic which is one of the most influential companies at determining the path forward in real estate they've just published their home price index and they are projecting that there will be at least 10 percent appreciation this year with a slowdown to around 3.8% appreciation next year. 
So if you purchase now, it will feel expensive. However, in a quarter or six months, it's gonna feel like, wow, I, I'm glad I got in when I did. So that is typically how things are with Boulder County real estate. Um, they're, everyone's always wishing that they bought 20 years ago. So call us with questions. We're happy to be a resource and please like, subscribe and share and we'll see you again in two weeks. Thanks.